What's up, YouTube? CJD here from Chris's Junkyard Designs. Got some uh, cars I opened up today. Uh, some were in the video yesterday that I showed you guys, um, and some were a few days ago. Um, pretty cool castings. I think you'll like them. Well, we'll get started. Um, the first few here are a whole bunch of flying customs from this year that Sammy C sent me. Which I am very grateful for because I've never I haven't seen these yet in the stores and it's an awesome set probably one of the best flying custom sets I've seen so very happy with the whole set it was really cool so this is the whole set except the auto I already found I already got the auto from somebody else they got ordered it on, on a uh, auction or something I don't remember but right, we'll start off with the 69 Cougar Eliminator Mercury Cougar Eliminator this car is awesome Black walls. That's another thing I love about Flying Custom. I love the tires. The old tires they use. It's so cool. Red interior. Beautiful. Gloss black finish. With the purple and orange stripes. Run down the sides and on the top so you get no front and head light tampos. But it's still an awesome looking car. Very nice looking car. Love this casting. Okay, next flying custom is the 65 Mustang Convertible, pretty cool, I still much prefer the ones with the opening hood, this feels so light, like it's not even die cast, when you get those other ones, they're awesome, but it's still a cool car, it's got a really nice steering wheel in it too, surprising, not just the disc, it's got, actually got detail in it. You can see it right there. A little bright, but it's got a pretty nice steering wheel. I like beautiful blue color. More black wall tires. The wheels are awesome. Love them. Definitely reminds me of when I was a kid. A lot of the cars came out like this. Nice casting. Then we got the 69 Shelby GT500. There's another beauty. Not too much of this casting at all. I don't know if I even have another one in look yet. And this has got the gold black walls, which is really awesome looking. Look at that. It goes perfect with that car. <clears throat> got the roll bar in the back, which is cool looking. Really nice car. Nice gloss red paint. It's more of an orangey red paint. The camera's showing it as a pink color red, but it's not. It's more of like an orange red. I don't know if you can see it better there. That's the real color. Really nice. Nice detailed interior. It's got nice features in there. That's got a nice steering wheel, too. Nice. Next up, my favorite casting, 69 Chevelle SS 396. Another beauty. Same wheels. Love it. Black interior. Beautiful orange color. Some yellow accents and some brown, it looks like. Really nice. an awesome set they put out this year. I really like it. She is a beauty. Nice gloss orange color. Beautiful color. Up 66 Nova. This one's really awesome. Look at this, guys. Beautiful metallic purple. Very nicely done with the blue accents all over it. Gorgeous. The wheels are awesome, too. Perfect looking car. Love it. 
black interior. Here, too much of a gray bumper, so they should have used chrome, in my opinion. It would have been better, but it's still cool looking, though. I don't have too much of this casting either. I don't have too much 66 Novas. Look at that color. Beautiful color. Nice looking car. Next up, 86 Monte Carlo SS. What an awesome casting. I love collecting. This is really nice. I love that brown interior that comes with You don't see that too often. Like a brown leather interior. That's awesome looking. Really nice. Goes good with the accents on the car with the brown. And the black. The wheels are awesome on this. I love those wheels. Any six spokes? Five spokes. Like a deep dish five spoke. Really nice. Gold. Just a gloss white. Nice color. And headlights are part of the windshield, which is cool. Very nice. That interior makes it, I'm telling you. It's awesome that they did that. Okay. Last one I have for Flying Customs. 85 Camaro Iroxy. Oh, the casting I love collecting. On the gold black walls, awesome. Black interior, <clears throat> great casting. Nice yellow, gloss yellow color. Really nice. So that'll do it for the Flying Customs. Once again, Sammy, thank you very much for sending these. I really appreciate it because I love this set. I really do. All these cars are awesome. Go good in the collection. I collect all these castings that are in here. So thank you very much. Next, we'll go over some of these that I got out of that nine pack yesterday. Um, this one's a 2017 Honda Civic. I have a couple of these. I don't go crazy over collecting these, but. They always detail them really nice. This is a beautiful blue color, and the rims, I think, look good on it. It'll go good in there. I think I have four or five other variations of this car. Something like that, a white, a red, maybe a black. I don't remember. I'll have to look. But Xbox does a good job. The tail lights are right on. Looks really good. Headlights, nice tampos of headlights, it's got the fog lights. This is all done up. It looks really good and beautiful blue color too. Always a fan of that. Okay, next up we got the Mazda 2019 Mazda 3. Cool casting. I think this is my first one of this casting. I don't have any of this one. This wouldn't be something I would have went out and bought if I seen it there, but it was in a nine pack and I knew it'd be really detailed, so better than a fantasy casting. It's a beautiful red color, just like the ones on the road. They have a beautiful red color moth. The moth has beautiful red and a beautiful blue color. It's pretty cool. It's a hatchback. I like the way hatchbacks look. Nicely tampoed front and back. The wheel choice I think is good. Very nicely done. Okay, we next up we got another Mazda that was in the pack is the CX-5 in black. There's another one I wouldn't have picked up probably, but it looks good. It was in the pack. I don't think I have any variations of this either. I'll have to look, but really nicely detailed. Once again, 
front and headlights. The wheels look great on it, too. They did a great job picking wheels out for these. She looks good. Nice gloss black. Pretty cool. So we got the armored car, which is okay. Not something I run out and get because it's plastic. But they came with it, so it's not too bad. National security. Like I said, plastic body, metal base. Nice detailing on the sides, nothing front and back. Just like a looks like a cheap plastic toy to me. I don't even know if I'll keep this thing. Who knows? I'm going to gas land it or something. Who knows? Not the best, I don't think. Not when it's plastic. If this was metal, it would be sweet. But I know why. Uh, okay. This was the exclusive in the pack. This is, let me see the year. I forgot. 18. Rubicon Jeep Unlimited. Needs some front detailing. Bad. Not to do that because it looks horrible without it, but the rest of the car looks sweet. Wheels look awesome. Good choice in wheels. But that front is just, ugh. I gotta do something with that. And she'll be perfect. But I think it's really cool. Looks really good. Nice red color, red orange color. And last one, the other ones I didn't put in there because I had them ready. And, um, that was that with that. This was the star for me in the pack. This is what made me buy it. This shell, this 1955, is it? Ford F100. And panel delivery and the shell delivery this is awesome love these panel delivery trucks just gonna detail that front up a little bit in the back shouldn't take much at all this will be great put it in my shell gas station that I have I believe I showed that in a video, one of my earlier videos, the first one, if you wanted to see that. Got the green light shell gas yeah, station and the accessory pack. But this is awesome. I'm so glad I got this truck. Really nice. I've never seen it on the pegs. I haven't seen it in any collection, so I don't know if it's just in the nine pack. It's like another exclusive, but they didn't call it an exclusive. I haven't seen it anywhere else. But I'm glad I got it. Okay. Next up's the M Matchbox Super Fast 66 Dodge D200. This thing is sweet. Skyjacker livery. Glad I finally snagged this one. Really cool truck. Nicely detailed in the back and the sides and the roof. The front isn't, but I can fix that quickly. And plastic base on these with the rubber tires, which looks awesome. I like it. I love these old big Dodges. Freaking sweet looking. Really cool. Okay, next up we got a Auto World Square Body Trailer, which is really cool. So that back opens up and that side door opens up. I took pictures on Instagram and opened them up, but there's not, you know, there's nothing in there. It's nothing that great to see. It's chrome in there. But what an awesome trailer. You get the square body in the back. 
truck and the square body on the side, and you have a picture of the truck in the front, all the way around or something. It's awesome. I really like it. So I'll have it hooked up to one of my square bodies. And display. Really cool. I'm glad I got it. Looks really nice. Okay, next up, we got the Muscle Machines 1993 Ford Mustang SVT Coupe. Supercon um, variation, so you won't find this in the pegs. You have to go buy this one. But she's awesome. Nice detail on the motor, headlights, or done. everything's done. <clears throat> Which it should be. Little B. And this is for Supercon Las Vegas. I like the wheels on it. They look pretty cool. Muscle machines. Oh, way. Las Vegas, Let's see right there. there go. And the underneath's done like a muscle machine. It's pretty cool. I like it. A pretty cool car. Okay. Next up. I believe this is a 41 Willys Gasser Moon Eyes M2. Yep, these are all going to go back in their acrylic cases. I just took them out if you guys can see them. These all came in the M2 cases. Um, this is awesome. Great car. I love the 41 Willys Cooper. Coupe Gasser. I love them. You got the yellow windshield, which looks great on here. The Moon Eyes livery, nice black. I mean, this is, I'm telling, every M2 I've been getting has been doing good. I think they're getting a little bit better in their quality. Um, wheels are good. Everything's good. Nothing's busted. So, I'm getting lucky lately. Green light is the one that's starting to be the worst one now again. With their wheel issues and their freaking windshields that they can't keep clean for some reason. It has some cutting fluid or some whatever crap it is in there. In every model. That's the ones that are my biggest problem now. M2's been doing it. And that beautiful gloss. No, no, nothing wrong with the paint. She's a beauty. Let's go with the moon. Nice headlight detail. Really cool car. I really like this. Really glad I got that. Alright, save the next, the best two for last. Supercon. This is a 79 Chevy Silverado. Oh, this thing is freaking awesome. What a beautiful car. Our tonneau cover does come off. Um, so if you get it, I know some guys don't like opening it, but there is a band around there, and it already left a mark on the top there to scrub out. To hold a tonneau cover on. It's got a nice pink lip around the wheels. The gold. Gold interior. What a what a beautiful car. Beautiful truck. Nothing wrong with it. She rolls good. The hood opens, but... I think the engine... Kind of shitty. Set way in there. It's black. It's not really detailed that much, so... I wouldn't have made the hood open at all, but they did. What, what an awesome truck. Really nice looking. Beautiful. Heavy too. 
So these are heavy one. This gold interior, and I can show you. I'll get it off here. See, the tonneau cover comes off, just the black bed. Very, I love these wheels. Nice metal base, screwed together. Okay, last up, 55 gasser, Supercon. So those doors open and they open very rough. I mean, they're very tight, so I'm just leaving them. I don't need them to open. There's nothing to see, it's just a gold interior. Orange Speed Shop. This this thing is just awesome. Wheels in the back are a little wonky on this one, um, but not that bad. Gold interior on this one as well. Like this has lensed headlights, I believe, and lensed tail lights. Beautiful gold color. Black flames, awesome. Man, that looks good. Metal base. Let me show you the base. They did gold on the supports there. Which is really nice. Supercon Vegas. Speed Shop. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Really like it. Well, that'll do it for me today, guys. Thanks so much. I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, thanks again for supporting my channel. Um, take care and have a great night.